Hello everyone, welcome to Yarn Wonders. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make this mesh stitch uh, shrug or a neck stitch uh, shrug. So, I'm, first I'm going to show you how to make the mesh stitch. Uh, for this, I'm using a size 2 yarn and a 4.5 mm crochet hook. You can do this in any size that you want. Okay. So, we are starting off with a slip knot. Okay. And I am going to chain a multiple of 8. Okay. I am just going to uh, show you the sample stitch here. And then I will show you how to make the shrug. Okay, so I'm making 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and 16. So 16 is a multiple of 8. You have to add 5 more stitches to that, 5 more chains to that. So the foundation chain for this stitch is uh, a multiple of 8 plus 5. So now into the 4th stitch, or into the fourth chain from the hook, you have to make a double crochet. One, two, three, and four. Okay, we are making a double crochet, and then we're going to chain six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And you're going to skip six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, and into the seventh and eighth, you're going to make. Uh, two double crochets okay so one two three four five six seven and eight so we went to this one yeah. here you're going to make one double crochet if you're not familiar with the double crochet stitches uh, please watch my beginner crochet series and then you can come back and make this stitch so to the next one also we are making a double crochet okay so this chain can be as long as you want so it's going to be the same thing even if you make a longer chain i'm making another six chains one two three four five six and i'm going to skip six one two three four five six and into the 7th and 8th, I'm making another double crochet stitch. Okay. So that is the first row of this mesh stitch. Or you can call it the odd row. Okay. So you can see that it, it forms a nice uh, big uh, um gaps like this for the next row you're going to chain six again one two three four one two three four five and six okay one two three four five and six and into this uh, loop here you're going to make two double crochets except for the first row you will start stitching into these gaps here okay so now this is the second row so one two three four five six so now I've, again i made six chains now i'll be making two double crochets into this gap here so that's one double crochet and that's two double crochets so now again I'm going to crochet 6 chains and I'm going to do one double crochet into the second double crochet here into this one.
so in the odd row you start with uh, a chain six and a double crochet and end with two double crochet stitches in the even row you do you start with this side again you start with uh, this chain stitch from here and then end with a two double crochet stitch into the space okay so when you come back here again you will be doing it into the space here i hope you got the stitch okay so this is how it's going to be now i'm going to show you how to make so this is a straight jacket so all i have done is taken the chest measurement and divided it into uh, three parts that is one or uh, that is one part for the back that is if the chest measurement is 32 uh, you'll have to do a back panel of 16 and you have to do a front panel of 8 inch each so this is 8 inch and this is again 8 inches okay uh, this is going to be an oversized jacket so it really doesn't matter if uh, it uh, you know uh, covers up the whole of the front part because uh, it's going to be big and it, it, it's going to drape beautifully on your dress. Okay. And um, here what I've done is so I've, I've, I made three panels and I made a slip stitch here on both the sides. And I took the armhole measurement and in this part I've skipped uh, stitching the both the layers together. And again, when it comes to this, I have again slip stitched into the into a uh, slip stitch both the panels together okay so this is a very simple pattern all you have to do is have a mesh stitch you can try this out with any mesh stitch pattern uh, you can see the image at uh, here in the screen uh, this is how it looks uh, do try out this pattern if you like it or if you make a pattern using uh, this stitch do tag me on Instagram at Saumya underscore Yanwanders or use the hashtag Yanwanders. If you have any doubts, please leave it in the comment section below and do subscribe to my channel to mo learn more about crochet. Thank you.